Hey everybody, it's Gems again, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make duct tape flower pens. Um, I don't have green, so uh, I'm not going to use, I'm not going to make a stem, but I'm sure you can make a stem at home, because you know how to make a stem probably, you just wrap the duct tape around it. And I have two colors in here, it looks neat with two colors. Um, and I actually do have two colors of duct tape. Um, but, yeah, I guess I'll use both colors. So you want two rolls of duct tape. Now this is the same size, just more, less duct tape. You need two rolls of duct tape. And you're going to need some paper mate pens. Yeah. Or whatever, you're just going to need some thin pens with a cap. Um, you're only going to need one. So, unless you're planning on making more than one. So let's get started. So what you're going to do is, you can take, leave the cap on or take the cap off, it doesn't matter. Um, but I'm going to leave the cap on because I don't want to get pen stuff on me. So right now, just set your pen aside. Cut strips of duct tape that are about you want to cut strips of duct tape that are about that long. And you're going to fold them to make it look like this. And that's what it looks like. So this is the petal and this is the sticky part. So what you're going to do is you're going to start on here. Stick it on and then wrap it around your pen. And that's your first petal. And if you would just hold on one second, I'll be right back. Sorry about that. Okay, so um, I'm going to do two colors. So you're going to just keep doing the same thing until you have enough. Like it's pretty full. And you want your strip of duct tape to be like that long. So. What you do is you fold down one of the corners and just leave a little sticky over here. Fold it down all the way. Then you take this part and you leave it for the bottom. So you make like a point, like a house kind of thing. And then you want to put it on. Here and wrap it on both sides. And you don't want it to be that, you want it to be nice and clean. So you can see your two little petals, and you just keep going back and forth with the paper. You can also make um, the petals ahead of time and just stick them on. And I'll have my brother um, make the petals. Do you know how to make them? Yeah. And then he'll give me them and I'll stick them on. So. Okay, so. You can use this if you want. This is my brother. He's also gem because this is for the whole family. 
Brother, a lesson in flower making. Of course you do. Okay. What you do? Take your duct tape, about that much, or that much duct tape, and cut it. Then you fold down one of the edges so that you have a little bit of duct tape left. <laughs> Then you fold down this edge down there, so it makes a petal, and then you put it on your flower. Sense. Reserve the duct tape. Thank you. Just make me petals. And we're starting to get a flower. Petals. <laughs> And you don't want to go any longer than this, because then it looks weird. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay. And you just keep wrapping the petals on. Until you, you think it's full enough. On this one I did purple and zebra print, but I don't have either of those because I left them at home. I just brought my piece.